Hello, Gamer Nome is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob grind, but there is a twist. He will use a new sword for every new island that he reaches. But before we start, you can show your support by using star code Gamer Nome when purchasing your Robux. With every purchase you make, 5% will go to me, and this will really help me make better videos for each and every one of us. Where the actor slam. Oh, they're dancing forward. There's your slam. There's the dump. Okay guys, so as you can see, this noob account already has 100,000 bellies. Yes, I've been collecting money from chests. So for our first sword, we're going to use the legendary katana for 1,000 bellies. Okay, so let's try it on the bandits. Let's not forget that I am doing this in the public server, which means that there are lots of players, just like this one, trying to flex. There you go. So guys. Imagine level 1 and someone is doing this to you. <laughs> Guys, he is flexing. Well, anyway, let's just continue grinding. The first skill of the katana is the quiet rush. Guys, this is single target, which is not really good for grinding. So we are going to rely on our left clicks. There you go. We haven't leveled up that much. And again, guys, someone flexing has arrived. A flame user. A while ago, it's rumble, right? So here you go. He keeps on killing my mobs. But guys, this is a public server, so we can't do anything about it. Fire. Well, anyways, let's just continue grinding. By the way, you are a flame fruit user. I made a video of one to max. I will put the link on the upper right side of the screen. Okay, so we're gonna grind here until it's level 15. Sadly, guys, we won't be able to unlock the second skill, but don't worry. On the next island, the jungle, we're going to use the sword cat class, which is almost the same as the katanas at 1000 bellies. Here you go. Our first target is the gorillas. Check that out, guys. A phoenix user tried to attack us. Well, anyway, let's focus on grinding from now on. Guys, it's very easy. Just lure three, right? Look for a high ground. Use your left clicks, guys. They cannot attack you here. There you go. Very easy. Yes. Yes, I am growing very strong. Target here is level 20. And after you reach that level, you can now start defeating the Gorilla King. So here, you're going to use your Z skill and your left clicks plus dash. So left click, dash forward. Left click dash forward and that's it. Don't worry, we are going to unlock our second skill, the air slash. This one, this is multi-target. This will help you easily defeat the Gorilla King. So you're gonna grind here until you reach level 30. For our next island is not the frozen village, but we're here to buy the enhancement and the sky jump. Now for our next island, the real one, the pirate village, we're gonna buy the dual katana. Good thing that it already has a first skill, the whirlwind. So this is multi-target, which means grinding is faster. Guys, if you don't want to get damage, oh, it's laggy. Just jump here and use your Z skills until you defeat the pirates. Okay? When you unlock your second skill, the X skill, the tornado, multi-target, which means grinding will be a lot faster. Level 40, our target will be brutes. Go. So you're gonna grind here until you reach level 60. Reminder, you cannot fight Boggy because he is immune to swords. Next island is the desert. For our next sword, guys, we're gonna use the Iron Mace. Guys, this is one of my favorite swords. I'm gonna show you why. Check this out. The first skill is the Mace Smash. So this is multi-target, which is really good. There you go. So you're gonna grind Masteries here until you unlock the Killer Combo. For the Killer Combo, it's also multi-target and high damage, which is really good. Level 75, you're gonna start defeating the Desert Officers. All the new players out there, I suggest this sword for you. So again, we're gonna grind here until you reach level 90. Next island is the Frozen Village. So here, we're gonna buy the Triple Katana. And we're gonna go Zoro Mode. It costs 60,000. Guys, we don't have skill yet. So we're gonna defeat Snow Bandits one at a time. To unlock a skill. So guys, there you go. The Air Slashes at Master 20. If you want to make things easier, you can jump again on high ground and use your X uh, Z skill. Sorry, Z skill. No problems grinding here. At level 105, you can start defeating the boss in this island, Yeti. Sadly, we won't be unlocking the Violent Rush. Yes, our X skill. But don't worry, more swords to come. So guys, before we move on to our next island, we're gonna buy the pipe. This costs 100,000. First is Zoro, now it's Sabo mode. Okay, so heading on to the Marine Fortress, we're gonna start defeating the Chief Petty Officers. First skill is the Rage Combo, and this is single target. <laughs> Don't worry, you can jump here on this area and just use your left clicks. The range 
of the pipe is kinda long, which means grinding this mobs is really easy. Check that out. So target level here is 130. At mastery 50, we're gonna unlock the Earth Smash. This is multi-target. There you go. Finally, something good. And if you're gonna ask me, I prefer the maze. Okay guys, so at 130, Vice Admiral, this is how you defeat him. Lure him right. There we go. Here, jump. And left clicks. That's it guys. Sometimes he might damage you, but don't worry. If ever he jumps here, just go on the other side. Wall strap. Okay? That's easy guys. Very easy. And to take advantage of this, we're gonna do server hop until you reach level 220. Yes, because this sword is not really good for grinding. Our next sword is owned by my favorite character in One Piece. And that is the Saber, right? So you need to defeat Saber Expert. Please do the quest first. Guys, it's kind of hard because someone attacked me, this Magma Fruit user. But I almost defeated him. There you go. But instead, he ran. So it's fine, guys. It's fine. So we're gonna continue defeating the Saber Expert. There you go. Again, guys, this is 100%. Once you defeat him, you will get the Saber Sword. Oof, he died, guys. That's not my fault. <laughs> Again, a reminder, we are here in the public server. Oh, this dragon fit user. No! No! Yes, guys, we got off, but he defeated it. And still, we got the prize, the saber, so he is forgiven. Now, Shanks mode. Off to our next island, the prison. So here, we're gonna start defeating the warden. So guys, we're gonna do wall strat here. Just use left clicks, and that's it. Very easy, guys. And good thing, we're also going... To use the same strategy with the chief warden and the swan guys we're gonna unlock our first kill the deadly rush this is the deadly rush but again our focus here is wall strat and server hop okay check this out guys i thought this dude is going to attack me he even tried swinging his sword but he just wants to show that we have the same accessory and sword <laughs> but anyway shout out to you akuma Let's continue grinding. Again, guys, we're just gonna do server hop here. Do wall strat. Grind, grind, grind until you reach level 350. Sadly, we won't be unlocking the triple slash. And for those wondering what is our next sword, our next sword is the Warden Sword. Yes, we are able to get the sword from this boss. There you go. So next island is the Magma Village. So here, we're gonna start with the military. Soldiers and our main goal here is to unlock both skills, the multi-target slash, there you go, and also the tornado slash. Once we unlock both skills, I think we are ready to defeat the Magma Admiral. So here it is. We're gonna grind here until you reach level 425. After that, our next sword is the Soul Cane. So you can find it here, it's kinda hidden, there you go, living skeleton. And we're gonna spend 750,000 to buy this. There you go. It's broke time. Okay, guys. Next island is the underwater city. Sadly, we don't have skills unlocked yet. But the worry, the enemy here, the fishman lord, is very easy to defeat. Just lure him here. You can use left clicks to defeat him. Okay, very easy, right? There you go. We're going to unlock the soul beam here, the first skill. And continue. Leveling up. There you go. Left clicks, left clicks. Guys. We got the trident and the inventory is so far so I decided to use the trident. Oh bonus, we've used two swords in one map. There you go. So again, we're gonna grind here. Do server hop. Guys, we're gonna unlock only the first skill. The trident throw. This is the first skill. There you go. Really looks nice. Spider-Man. <laughs> well anyways, our target level here. Oh no guys, this is a Magma Awakened user. I don't know why he's here. But it's fine, he helped me defeat. The Fishman Lord, even though he defeated me, he said sorry, guys. But in the Philippines, we will say. Anyway, back to grinding. Target level is 500. So next up is the Skylands. For our next sword, guys, we're going to use the Vicento. We are going white beard mode now. Okay, so first we're gonna start with the God's Guards. We're gonna unlock. Both skills, okay? Now I'm gonna unlock both skills. Why gamer no? Because we can use the Quake Spear to go to the upper yard. <laughs> That's my only reason. Wait, there you go, guys. So our target here is Whisper. Guys, we can do the Stone Strat. So lure him here. He cannot damage us with his cannon. 
there you go after that you can hit him with everything you want left click z or x skill okay so guys we're gonna continue grinding here do server hop but watch out for other players but don't worry guys some other players uh just made a mistake of hitting you but they won't kill you so make sure to check that first and there you go as you can see we're even helping each other to grind okay continue grinding until you reach level 625 another dragon fruit user <laughs> But don't mind him, just focus on the grind. Again guys, the technique in Blast Fruits is to just focus on your goals. And our goal here is to grind. Okay? 6 to 5. Next island is the Fountain City. But the sword that we're gonna use is the Dual Headed Blade. Okay? So guys, I chose Bicento before this because Bicento X skill can help you go in the upper yard. So guys, don't forget to buy Observation Hockey. And after that, again, to the final island, the Fountain City. So we're gonna attack the Galley Pirates here. Guys, this is our last mob. So you can do wall strat here and grind masteries. Guys, the assassinate is not that good, so I still focus on doing the wall strat. There you go. Don't worry, we are going to unlock the Raging Wind here, which will make our grinding faster. So guys, if you like this video and we're gonna reach maybe 100,000 views, I will make a part 2. Same with the previous one. Remember, the fruits every 50 levels, new fruit, guys. I'm already making that video. So guys, again, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate y'all. This is Gamer Nob, and Gamer Nob out.